Ah! Hey guys, this is me, what's a dad? And today, I'm going to be doing a rant on the Robot Monster episode, The Bat Itch. Oh, there are so many things wrong with this episode. Anyways, without further ado, let's get this rant started and on the road. Five, four, three, two, one. Be dead. <sighs> really, Nickelodeon? Really, Nicktoons? I know, and my favorite, Nicktoons. So, you can do a lot better than this. <sighs> the patents has got to be, without a doubt, the worst Robot Monster episode I've ever seen in my entire life. Period. Ah, oh, the pet is more like the punishment. Oh my freaking god! This episode has got to be one of the worst episodes I've ever seen. Period. Ah, oh. so here's basically what happens in this episode. Rob Mom and Monster are watching their favorite TV show in the living room. Ah, oh. there they find a commercial for a horror tube. <sighs> and then they don't shoot a hoops up and realize they don't have any money on them. Then they see a glasses Gordon Springer asking them for some random money. <sighs> Roman wants to say yes. <sighs> they get worried. <sighs> and then Robot says the address of the package. Ah, uh, which is obviously what this episode is about. Ah, uh, because Robot Monster don't have enough money. At last, this Gordon Screenser decides to make extra money by on them to repair it to an unsuspecting Screenser. Or an unexpected Screenser, no less. Ah, uh, then they get to the address, a hundred and crime suite. Ah. Uh, and then this, uh, this is what I see in the background. We see a random robot's head, along with some poor hat being abused, a dead with abusing hats, Nickelodeon. Uh, first you do this, and now you do Pub Pro. Great, Miss Marty. What will you think of next as your who uh, who? Uh, Oh, punishment! That is some weird hound! Uh, why? Why would they go over patents to some scary, creepy street? Why? It's just why? Uh, also, this episode had some sort of whole unquote. Mood whiplash. First, it's an innocent little episode where Robot Boxer deliver packets to one stranger to a completely messed up city. A hundred head crime suite. Ah. Ah. I have been completely pissed off. Ah. Oh, hey. So basically, this episode hates Moon with Plus to a new level. Uh, it transforms itself from uh, a lighthearted, immediate, innocent little episode where Robot Bots and Lover Pat it to a stranger to a completely messed up dark episode uh, where they have to deliver Pat at a hundred crime street to. Two, none of her dead. A person with eyes. A creepy person of eyes, I might add. Ha! Ah, why an Elodian? Why would you do such a thing like this? Also, where's his face? Ah, he used to really sell himself. His eyes are creepy. Ah, they're even more creepier than Doran Dale's eyes. Ha! Ah, 
Here's what else happens in this episode. Robot and monster get chased by a random robot monster wearing a rainbow ring for no apparent reason. Uh, they end up getting chased around the hell no less. Then they meet up with monsters Uncle Rum Hopes as a police officer no less. Uh. And then when he finally arrived the third episode turns out to be a surprise party for one character who's missing an arm for some odd reason. Huh. And the pet is inside. It's just over arm. Give me a thought that break. Huh. This episode hates unexpected dark episode to a whole new level. In fact, this episode is a literal third episode. Oh, it went to an innocent, light-hearted hail where robot monster delivers some sort of packets to one unsuspecting stranger. To a completely weird, dark, creepy, and messed up storyline where mom robots of themselves have to deliver packets to a creepy, scary city on 110 Prime Street. Oh, why Nickelodeon? Why? Why would you mess up Roman Master like this? Fit Riders Fit! Ah. Seriously. This scene with a poor hat dog views, it basically offers to eat or not to eat all over again. Because ah. they do the same thing! Ah. In this episode, it's just like the Pat It's is a dark episode as well. It hates it literally. Ah. Uh, so basically, that's all I have to say about this episode. The storyline is messed up. The plot is creepy and scary. The sound effects are a little dead. Ah. Uh, and basically, the episode, the episodes, it's just. Ah. Uh, how can I hit? Uh, how can I say this? This episode is Little Nightmare Phil! Yeah. Uh, we I'm never watching this thing. Ah! Thank God I'm uh, I hope I never run into this thing diaper ever again. Ah! Uh, and thank God I never have to watch this thing diaper ever again. Ah! Uh, you know what? I'm just, uh, sorry about that, you guys. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just so pissed off about this episode. I literally can't deal with this right now. You know what? Screw it. Uh, the plot's messed up. The storyline's awful. The sound effects are creepy. Uh, and every bit about it is nightmare food. I really do feel bad for that poor hat and the abuse. And the Arthur episode as well. Ugh. Anyways, do you know who likes this episode? D.A.O. He likes this episode a lot. A lot of his cousin Dora. Do you know who hates this episode? Ugh. Do you know who hates this episode? Pinky from Pinky to Eat Do. She can't stand this sixteen crap. And she too fits this creepy episode. Oh. Speaking of which, why would they air this on the Zunar Pool TV? Why? Just why? It's, if Hits were to see this right now, uh, when they see this, they're going to scream their heads off. And their parents would comfort them. Uh. Seriously, Mrs. Ray Fever. Seriously, Mike tonight. Seriously, Miss Marty. Why would you meet an episode like this? Uh. So screw the package. Screw it. Uh. And screw its other episode, The Dark Knight. Bad news, beating ears, and all the other episodes will always be way better than Robot Monsters, The Package episode. Uh. 
out for it.